Hey, what's up, guys? So, right now it's Thursday. And I just woke up, turned on my phone, and then it was 10 o'clock. So, I just went in the bathroom and brushed my teeth and washed my face. And then I was gonna go in my mom's room and ask her, can I have some money to go to work? Like, to give me something to eat when I go on my break. But she's asleep, so that's why I just didn't do it. So that's why I came in my room and then got dressed. And then, yeah, it's Thursday. So, and I'm finna get ready for work. And I gotta make sure I have all my stuff with me. <clears throat> Let's see what's going on outside. My stepdad is gone, but I think when I well when I woke up like like one or something, then I went back to sleep. I heard my mom and stepdad were arguing, so that's why my papa was telling my mom to open the door for him so he can lay down. But she was saying that she's tired and she don't feel like getting up, and that's why she refused and then she just went to sleep. And then my papa start his car and then he drove to his mom's and then my mom woke up and started eating breakfast and then she went back to her rooms and then she came out and see if the baby was all right and then she went to the bathroom and then she busted her toe while she was in the bathroom like she didn't know if she was gonna walk in that or like hit her toe in that door and then once she came back out of the bathroom, she's still checking on the baby. And then she went back in her room and just looked for something to cover her toe up because she bumped her toe so bad. And once she covered her toe, she started laying back down again on the bed. And then she was talking to Papa about he's not going to come back here anymore. And yeah, so... At Goodwill yesterday, there was like a fight between two ladies. And then I was in the back still working. I was working on books. And then Junior went out to the sales floor and saw what was going on. And then he went to the office door. And then he told the manager that the lady was fighting. They was fighting over some clothes and a suitcase. And then Junior, he went to the break room to see if he could find his glasses, but he couldn't. So that's why he he didn't um, come back to the back and help us work a little bit. Like me, I was sweeping, I was dust mopping, and then Eric, he was on the forklift dumping some clothes. Like he was on the a clamper forklift. And then when, once Carlos came, he asked me that, have I seen Junior? And I told him that he's in the break room looking for his glasses. And then Carlos was walking around the back to find something to do. And then once the other manager came in the back, Ning called Carlos to tell, like, we're going to do a meeting. And so Ning went into the office and told Jeanette that we're going to do a meeting. And then he went to the salvage side and told Nick that they're doing the meeting. And so I went to the bathroom and then I came back and then we started doing the meeting around the back, not on the sales floor because that's where customers are shopping at. And so once we got done with the meeting, we fill out these slips where we give a celebration, like talk about celebration, like how we do a good job. And so we do that like like more often than just working and working by process and pushing boats out to the sales floor. So yeah, I'm gonna get ready and look for my stuff to take with work with me. So like my snacks, my glasses cleaner, my chargers and my AirPods. So like if I'm in the break room or anything like that, I can just use those to listen to music and then just eat my snack and then go from there. So I'll see you guys 
when I'm outside. Peace. Okay guys, so I'm outside. I thought I didn't have my AirPods in my pocket. I was standing right in front of the door. And then I went inside, unlocked my door and went into my room. See if I could look for it again. And then once I filled my pocket the second time, I didn't realize that I didn't have it. So I have it now. And I just went back outside and threw away that trash before I was gonna leave to work. And my mom, my niece are sleeping. So I locked the door behind myself. And at work yesterday, I was walking right by this construction worker truck or whatever you call it. There was like a lot of dirt sitting on the sidewalk because they're building it for people that goes on the wheelchair. Like two weeks ago, they, when I walked in, they was building this um, button where you have to push it and then they'll open the doors for you. So that's why they're building the sidewalk there. And then David, he went into the break room, started eating his lunch. And then once he came back, he was talking to Nick about what road that should we pull in. And then once he went back in the break room again, he started looking for Taryn. And then finally, he made it back to the back to help us clean up a little bit. And so I'll talk to you guys when I get in the place. Okay guys, so I'm in the locker room. So I'm just gonna chill in here until 11 o'clock. And then I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. Okay guys, so I'm in the break room right now. And I'm finna get my snack right here. I just got back from watching the safety video. It's about the harassing video thing. And then once that's clear, I told him, can I go on my break? And he said yes, and then I forgot to tell Carlos. So hopefully he doesn't get mad at me because I'm just gonna tell him after I'm getting done through my break. Carlos, he's just working on the forklift. He's dumping clothes right now for the boats or for the customers. He's dumping clothes in the boats I met and then he's gonna take it out to the sales floor. So see you guys when I get off work. Peace. Hey, what's up guys? So it is pretty hot out here guys. So I was just wearing my jacket, but I just told myself just take it off because it's gonna be a little bit warmer when you, like, when you walk outside. So I just got it wrapped around my waist and it's pretty darn hot out guys. So, what happened today, it was a good day. Like, nothing bad happened. No customer was fighting at all. And my friend, Junior and Abdi, gonna play a joke on me, saying that, Nadre, why are you chewing on... You know what, I don't want to talk about it, because it's just... Like, they were like, pissing me off and stuff and my fault for saying that word I don't swear a lot and then Junior he was he was working so hard he was pushing the boats with us and then he helped us fill out the schedule like the row was done now let me see if nobody's back okay so nobody dang guys I don't know if y'all can see that, but that house on the bottom right there looks pretty, like right over there, it looks pretty empty. So they definitely moved out. Oh my gosh, these bugs guys are creeping me out. Cause I'm not gonna walk through there and I don't know where these bugs come from. How do they even exist in this forest? So, so Abdi at work, he was on his phone. Like he wasn't doing no work at all. I keep telling this dude, get off your phone. 
get off your phone. You're not supposed to be on your phone. And so he just keeps going and then he goes down to the salvage to get some bolts. And then he gonna get mad at Allison because he was playing too much. All right guys, so I'll see you guys when I get home. Okay guys, so I'm gonna end this video right here and I'm sorry that I didn't get a chance to film when I got home because I was so very tired. It was so busy yesterday. So don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys on another video. Peace.